else that surrounds you. Well, what would you know? No, oh, just look around you. It's mad about Alice. Please don't remind me. Mad about Alice. All right, don't go on about it. But we, we know, know despite the things we say, we wouldn't have it any other way. Except maybe today. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> Mum, hmm? there's something I don't understand. Well, tell me, that's what I'm here for. The East Ender star said that the first thing that attracted her to her husband was the size of his lunchbox. <laughs> really? Why would somebody marry somebody just because of the size of their lunchbox? Or well, maybe they like big sandwiches. But look, here's my lunchbox. Why would that attract a woman? <laughs> Listen, Joe, if I tell you everything now, you'll have no surprises for when you grow up. Here's your lunch, your drinks in the fridge. You better get a move on, cos Auntie Kate's taking you to school today. Yes. What causes magnetism? Well, it's, um, magnet, really. Um, <laughs> I mean, without a magnet, it, it's pretty hard to get magnetism up and running. I mean, for instance, if you have two pieces of metal and no magnet, you see? <laughs> Clearly going nowhere. Is this as good as my education's gonna get? Miss Caroline, I don't know. You'll be at school in a minute. Your science teacher must know. My science teacher used to be a PE teacher. Mm. I'll ask Dad when he comes to pick me up for the weekend. Are you suggesting that your dad knows more about magnetism than me? Yes. All right. <laughs> but I will find out. I won't let the fact that he doesn't live here anymore hold back your education in any way. Hi. Hey. Morning late, Aunt Kate. I'm not late. I am late. Joe, get ready. I am ready. Where's your lunchbox? Here. Where's my coffee? There. How the hell are you so together first thing in the morning? <laughs> <laughs> By the way, you're taking Sancha from next door to school this morning. My mother's working nights. Great. So now I'm a taxi service as well as a teacher. Well, it's always good to have something to fall back on. I'd do it myself, but I've got to get to work early this morning. Today's the day we find out whether we've got the redesigning of the bar. Well, you know what it means if you do. What? Free jeans. Uh, <laughs> go and put your coat on you. Um, by the way, what causes magnetism? Magnets? <laughs> Very helpful. Joe just asked and I said I'd find out. Well, when you find out, tell me. I can use it in science. Anything to get out of PE. Oh, that'll be my tights. You cook your underwear in the microwave? Yeah. It's the quickest way to dry them. Does it work? <laughs> yeah. What setting do you use? The same for scrambled eggs. Unless they're wooden, then it's jacket potato. <laughs> <laughs> they just need a pair of legs in them. <laughs> hey, Sancha. Oh, what have you got in there? Hamster. Oh, that's nice. I used to have a hamster when I was little. Called Buttons. What's he called? Specimen 22. <laughs> Sweet. I suppose you call him Spesh for short. <laughs> or Spesh a mini. <laughs> when you're being playful. Are you ever playful? As in playing? Playtime? Play? <laughs> what are you feeding him? I used to give mine raisins soaked in milk. Chloroform. <laughs> Won't that knock him out? It's better that way. They're not supposed to be awake when you're dissecting them. <laughs> <laughs> they would suffer. They would wriggle. <laughs> <laughs> okay. When you met your first boyfriend... Yes? Were you attracted by the size of his lunchbox? <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes. It was the talk of the staff room. Right. Joke. Bag, scarf, kiss. Oh, all right. Come on, you're going to be late for assembly. No, I'm case taking it. Oh. Am I? Yes, you're giving a talk on punctuality. <laughs> right, oh. let's be quick then. Come on. Come on, out. Wait, wait. Oh. Right, come on then. Thanks, Kate. OK, see you later. OK. Bye, Joe. Scott! I thought you were going to stay upstairs till everyone had gone. <laughs> they have gone. Oh. And I was lonely in that big bed all by myself. Oh, oh God, Joe's left his lunchbox. Maybe I can still catch him. Listen, I thought we said that you couldn't stay during the week when Joe was here. Uh, you asked me to. That's beside the point. Please understand that my life is less complicated if certain things are kept apart. <laughs> Hi, everyone. 
you all met Scott. I just got made. Hey. <laughs> nice lunchbox. <laughs> oh, thanks. <laughs> Ted, do these files have to go in alphabetical order? Yes. Is that strict alphabetical order? <laughs> what do you mean? Well, what I mean is, do I have to sort of, like, start off with A and kind of, like, end up with Z? <laughs> no, Jason, you can put B after Y if you like and let R move around wherever it wants. <laughs> <laughs> cool. <laughs> Sorry I'm late. Bit of a domestic crisis. Joe just met Scott. Hasn't he met him before? No, this time he was naked. Joe? No, Scott! <laughs> he came down in his pants and Joe now knows that we're more than just friends. And was Joe bothered by that? No, but you know who will be when he finds out. <sighs> Dr Doug. <laughs> Come on, you've been separated long enough. You must have had girlfriends. Yeah, none that Joe's ever met. Naked. <laughs> I'm glad you find this funny, Ted, but you know what Doug's like? It'll just give him more ammunition to add to his list of reasons as to why I'm such a terrible parent and it was all my fault we split up. You have no mail. <laughs> <laughs> you have no friends. You have no life. We have no clients. So no news, then? Ted! I love your new designs! <sighs> You'll notice the decorative style I've chosen lends a thematic link with the building's history in a way that evokes the character of the original site. A, a fruit and veg market? <laughs> Precisely. And the mouldings borrow heavily from the form of the humble tomato. Hey. Witty, I know. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, I hope we get this job. Our first bar, fixtures, fittings, deck all the lot. You know what that means, don't you? Free drinks. <laughs> it won't mean free drinks. Morning, Jason. How's the filing going? Great, yeah. This new system's so much easier. <laughs> <laughs> Just one thing, though, Ted. Oh, here we go. Where do I file this? Under A or Z? <laughs> Try M for map. Ah, yeah. And while you're there, file yourself under W. <laughs> <laughs> for Wally. <laughs> I love all the hardwood panelling. You did check that it was environmentally friendly. Yes, of course. Not Ted. yet. What? It's not as if the directors on the board of Friends of the Earth are yes, isn't they? Oh my God, Alice, this is a disaster. And that's probably why they haven't rung us. <gasps> what if they rang us really early this morning before we got into the office, and we'll never ever know? I'll ring one four seven one, see if someone's rung. Yeah. Yeah, someone's wrong. I'll ring him back, see who it was. <laughs> it's my mobile. <laughs> <laughs> Typical. <laughs> <laughs> See it stretching into the evening. Do you know what? Someone keeps phoning my mobile and not leaving a message. I'm going to call them back and have a right old go at them. <laughs> Gee. <laughs> Hello, TNA Interiors. Hello. <laughs> Hello. <sighs> well, I'm not letting this one go. Jason? Yes? You're an ass. <laughs> I just got an obscene phone call. <laughs> Hang on. Was that you all along? <laughs> Good one, yeah. I like it. His parent did invest a lot of money to start up the company. Can't we give it back? Are you going to get that? You get it. Uh, uh, no. <laughs> Hello, TNA Interiors. Yes, yes, it is. Oh, I see. <laughs>